Hey, how are you guys? So I'm here. Saint just debuted their new line, Demi, and we have 3D and now we have Demi. And you might be trying to figure out, well, what's the difference between the two? So let me start off with just basically, in a nutshell, what each is. So 3D comes in a compact. This is a triple decker. 3D comes in tins that look like this. These are highly pigmented creams. Uh, you have highlights, which all of these are your foundation. So it's like a paint by number uh, process. So you've got highlights, you've got your contour, you've got your bronzers, your illuminators, um, your shadows, and basically paint by number. For instance, when you're painting by number at home with like an art kit, you're not going to put purple in the red spot. It just doesn't, it just doesn't fly. So when it says in the 3D, uh, some like step-by-step -step thing, when it says to put highlight here, you put highlight here. When it, when it tells you to put your contour shade here, you put it here. Um, and you are color matched by your Saint artist. Now with Demi, which just debuted today, which is the 26th of January, 2021, um, this is the edit. We call these edits. We call these the palettes. So these are like edits, pretty much a palette. However, these are the tins. All right. So this is Demi color. Now you might be saying they look like eyeshadows. Certainly you can use the neutrals and maybe a tinge of color from the brighteners um, to create a new shadow or eyeshadow, but these are not eyeshadows. So what Demi is, is you look at your face, you're basically leaving about 80 or more of your face, like just, just your bare skin because our skin naturally pushes, um, it's an oil water mixture because our body's mostly water and we have oil in our skin. So that's what creates right now. You're seeing a luminosity of my regular skin. So with Demi, you're finding those like two or three distractions. For instance, I don't know, probably watching this video. I don't have any makeup on besides one spot and I'll show you, but, um, you can see that my distractions would be, I'm very blessed to have, you know, decent skin. I take really good care of my skin. So, um, believe it or not, I had third degree burns, was in the burn unit. And thankfully, thank God, um, my skin is okay. But my distraction, my main distraction is my under eye right in here. So that would be something that I would say, okay, let me find the true color that's present and then use the complementary color. So you're using color theory to address the issues or the distraction that you're trying to cover. So find would be under eye, mine would be maybe a few red spots. Now, here's the thing. Everyone thinks, oh, that's red. This is blue. This is purple. Most of the time, that is not the case. You're not going to see um, a very red spot unless it's angry red, for instance, like a sunburn or something of that nature. And so that's where color theory comes in. Note your complementary colors and then all around the color wheel. And Demi has been wonderful because it supplies its own color wheel and it helps you determine which colors to use where. Um, so tools, let's talk tools. Now let's talk tools. So I've addressed the tins and the colors, what it is with 3D and with Demi. Let's discuss what we need. So with 3D, it's a buildable foundation, buildable cream foundation. You're not layering one on top of the other unless you're color correcting. Now I just said buildable. So you can determine based on your preference of makeup, whether you want to do full coverage or a minimalistic uh, look. So we have different brushes all for different things. If you want um, a more full coverage, you're going to pick a more compact brush. If you want a lighter coverage, you are going to pick a very, you know, fluffy brush. Um, with Demi, you are not doing, like I said, you are not, and by the way, you have to set your makeup when you do 3D or any other makeup, okay? Because you're putting it on your entire face. You don't want it to move. Your face is moving a thousand one times a day. Mine probably moves like two or 3,000 times a day. I'm just making those numbers up. Um, I have a lot of facial features and a lot of expression going on 24 seven. Yeah. <laughs> All right, with Demi, you do not need to set your makeup because if you remember, you're, only, you're leaving about 80% of your natural skin. So with Demi, you are targeting and filtering the spots that are most distracting. So for me, I would solely only have a teeny bit of color here 
you will not see any texture whatsoever no texture and then if i um intended to sculpt which would be with the neutral colors these guys here now these are your main edit one filters i mean edit one neutrals because you're they're your ngs your nos and basically i'll break down that in a second so what you would be doing is sculpting where you would normally contour if you were using 3d all right again you do not need to set demi at all it will stay all day zero texture all right getting into each this one you get specifically color matched we tell you exactly the colors that you need all right obviously lip cheeks are totally up to you shadows totally up to you demi you purchase a specific edit or you could buy colors a la carte all right so angel edit one is for the lightest and the fairest of skin angel edit two is when you're a medium skin tone and angel edit three is if you are the darker if you have darker skin all right so are you going to use all of these colors absolutely not but this is an all year round palette or edit, I should say, okay? Because certain days you're going to see certain colors where you did not see them the day before. The 3D, you have to have, for instance, uh, a summer shade and a winter shade, all right? Because I don't know about you, but I am not the same shade unless I live in Florida. I am not the same shade as I am in the summer as I am in the winter time. So you switch out your highlights and your contours for summer and winter. This all year round, don't need to buy anything else. Um, and when I say I have been using the living daylights out of this palette for about three months, on off, on off, on off practicing, it still looks like this. So that's pretty amazing. All right, are we ready to get in to this? I'm gonna show you 3D and I'm gonna show you Demi. I'm gonna show you split face so you can see exactly what I'm talking about. Let's do this. 